Hello and welcome to the news from Bahrain International. I'm Sarah Lebrick. His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa issued Royal Order 32 of 2018, appointing two assistant undersecretaries in the Financial and Administrative Audit Bureau. The Royal Order stipulated the appointment of Khalid Yusuf Ahmed Al Husani as assistant undersecretary for Resources Information Systems and Qasim Ahmed Mansour Al Maloub as assistant undersecretary for Performance Audit, effective from the date of its issuance and to uh, published in the official Gazette. His Royal Highness, the Prime Minister, Prince Khalifa bin Salman Al Khalifa, chaired today the weekly cabinet meeting in Al Ghadaybiya Palace. His Royal Highness, the Prime Minister, directed the Ministerial Committee for Legal Affairs to study the notes presented by the Board of Directors of Bahrain Chamber of Commerce and Industry regarding commercial activity and business development. His Royal Highness followed up on the implementation of roads and infrastructures in various areas of the kingdom, including the development ro of roads in the villages of Maharag, the Ring Road in Maharag, and Raya Road. The cabinet also condemned the terrorist attack that targeted a security checkpoint in Al Qasim and affirmed the solidarity and support of the Kingdom of Bahrain to all measures taken to establish peace and security. It also hailed the Saudi efforts in combating terrorism at both the regional and international levels.
The cabinet discussed and approved a draft resolution concerning the development of an organizational framework for the registration of industrial ownership agents, which shall specify the provisions of registration and its conditions and application process. The cabinet approved the registration of the Arab Federation for Voluntary Activities as an international non-profit organization with the kingdom as its headquarters. The Ministry of Labor and Social Development is to follow up on the work of the organization. The Cabinet approved a Memorandum of Understanding between the Capital Municipality and the Municipality of Rabat to benefit from the Moroccan experience in the field of municipal developmental and cultural work and uh, to exchange administrative expertise. The Cabinet referred to the Ministerial Committee for Legal Affairs a draft resolution amending the license list for public transportation activities by including luxury car rental with a driver as a new activity. The Cabinet also referred to the Ministerial Committee for Legal Affairs the Memorandum of the Minister of Transportation and Telecommunication and a report aligning the National Qualifications Framework with the Scottish Framework for Accredited Hours and Qualifications. His Royal Highness the Prime Minister commended the extensive efforts of the Ministerial Committee for Legal Affairs chaired by Deputy Prime Minister Jawad bin Salam al -Arayid. He hailed the role of the Minister of Shura and Representatives Councils Affairs who represented the government in the meetings of the Shura Representatives Councils. The Premier also hailed the, the, and, and praised the, the cooperation between the government and the two councils. In this context, the Cabinet referred uh, to the Representatives Council's two draft laws with the government's opinion on encouraging and protecting investments and on the amendment of the traffic law. His Majesty the King's personal representative for charity work and youth affairs chairman of the Supreme Council of Youth and Sports and president of the Bahrain Olympic Committee, His Highness Sheikh Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa, was so close to achieve the first place in the 120 kilometer race in Chantiers, France, when he managed to enter first the equestrian village at the end of the fourth stage, but his horse was unable to pass the veterinary examination. First Deputy Chairman of the Supreme Council of Youth and Sports and President of the Bahrain Athletics Association, His Highness Sheikh Khalid bin Hamad Al Khalifa, attended the race. The leader of Bahrain's Royal Equestrian Team, His Highness Sheikh Nasser, asserted that the results achieved by the riders were positive, where he was keen to participate in the race with the largest number of riders in order to gain experience as they entered the three distances competition throughout the four stages. His Highness Sheikh Nasser led the Royal Equestrian Team in the Grand Prix, which was widely attended by various champions from the UAE, France and European countries, where the race is a preparation for the participation of His Highness in the World Championship to be held in the USA. His Highness Sheikh Nasser expressed his satisfaction with the participation and the technical capabilities provided by the race, or stressing that the track is similar to what is required for the World Championship. He also praised the riders' dedicated efforts to achieve the best results in the race. His Highness stressed that the positive results of the team's riders will contribute to the achievements of better ones in the future competitions, expressing aspirations for more positive results in the World Championship. His Highness added that the exit from the current race will not affect the preparation process for the World Championship, but the race was on the calendar of trial participations to complete the preparation period before the big event. The Minister of Housing, Basit bin Yaqub al Hamar, announced the completion percentage of Ar Ramli housing project, which reached 84.2% to construct 1,261 housing units and 46% of infrastructure work. He stated that the project's housing unit construction witnesses a rapid pace of implementation, noting that the advanced completion rate is an achievement that affirms the government's keenness on providing social housing that is suitable for citizens. The minister added that the Ramli project is one of the strategic projects that will largely contribute to fulfilling housing needs on the waiting lists. He affirmed that the project is a result of the Gulf Development Program, which will substantially contribute to speeding up the implementation rate of housing services in the cities and villages of the kingdom.